The eyes of the father rarely stray too far from the son. Though their journeys may take them to the opposite ends of the country, they are connected at the soul. They don't trust you because they didn't want to leave it out to the right. But you got the hill. The hill's going to make the ball go left. Well, on nine last week, you didn't, <laughs> I don't want to hear everything that. went right. They are the Stockton men. Dave and, well, Dave. The graying Dave at 54 is on the senior PGA Tour. His 27-year-old son on the regular tour, Dave Jr., sort of. I was not a junior until I turned pro in 91. I uh, was uh, just David Stockton. And I thought when I turned pro that I should put junior there a couple of reasons. One, because I'm proud of my dad and I want people to know that I'm my dad's son. And also that I wouldn't have people coming up going, are you any relation? You look at David, who is not a junior, he's got a different middle name than me, but goes out of his way to be called junior, which ticks me off because now people go out of the way to call me senior, and I'm not senior, right? I'm just Dave Stockton. He learned his golf at the feet of his father, and it seemed predestined that his sons would follow suit. Dave Jr. quickly did. Ronnie, who was trying to play the Canadian tour, caddied for his father for a while. And that was when Ronnie didn't know what his major was going to be in college, and he just took some time to figure it out, and what better way to figure it out to go out and make a lot of money caddying for dad, so. Yeah, I was frustrating for me. I'm out playing the mini tours with my brother's caddy and making more money than I was making. Obviously, they see each other very seldom and quickly grab at the occasional moment together. Finish the darn thing. Come on, Ed, rip it. Ready to finish. Ready to finish. Rip right through it. Hold the finish. There you go. I think I can open some doors for David, and I think the name does that occasionally for him. Uh, I don't see it as a liability. I just think we have the toughest profession in the world to try to play. Uh, and for the sons, Gary Player's son, Jack Nicholas's son, some of the ones that you expect to do really well that haven't, I think that's just the nature of this game, that it's very, very difficult, and you have to be in the right place at the right time. The chief door this father opened for his son was one to humanity. There you go. Thanks a lot. Can you for me? Yeah, signing next to my kid there, huh? And he's good with people, and he, and he enjoys helping people. And I grew up seeing someone like that, so it's, you know, I'm, I'm doing my best to try to emulate that also. And, um, you know, if I can be half the man that he's been in his life, I'll be a really good person. All one need do is watch the father's eyes to know the feeling of a job well done. Golfers, at least these two, travel in prides as well. Jim Huber, CNN Sports.